Yeah. Hello, it's Susan, and welcome now to mission 11 of the Yuki Kaze game. It's apparently a combat air patrol in area 663. Alright, let's get started and let's see what they have for us. Of course, always these same videos. Because they're cool. And our beloved airborne aircraft carrier, the Banshee! So we received reports that there's some jam activity in Area C63 and apparently that's where Ban Banshee is going to because actually Banshee the flying aircraft carrier he flies around the air bases like in a circle so apparently the gem are in front of his path so I think our objective is just go there shoot the gem down yeah so we have um, some interceptor aircraft scrambling from tab 15 or like the Ford Air Base from the 511th squadron and Yuki Arz is going as well he has to, ob ob to make an observation there look at the gen, look at their behavior <laughs> And we got an upgraded long-range missile, which is the AAM-5X. Thank you, Booker. Yep, yeah. uh, make sure you come back alive. You take off at 9 in the morning and uh, that's it. Have fun. Hey, so we got an upgraded miss. Oh, now both missiles are upgraded because they have the X. Gun pod. I, I, I don't need a gun pod. I think this one should do fine. Get eight of each. That's, that's some impressive firepower. And we can skip this launch sequence as well. A very nice artwork. All right. <laughs> Alright, let's wait a little bit. Let's see if our friends are gonna engage and destroy the gym there. And missiles fire. Hey, we lost one. Mayday, mayday. Can't control. Did I get jacked? Okay, let's help them. I'm not supposed to do this, but I'll do it because I'm such a nice guy. They should be able to catch that guy. It's only one. We have two. What is our, our friends flying? Is it the fan? The fan two, perhaps? Let me get a gun kill. Oh, what? I did not get one. Now I got him. Hey. Now, honestly, though. Except for the gun kills, this game is not very challenging. Kinda, it's a little bit disappointing. It's pretty much every missile you launch kills the jam. It's not even fun, and every time you release the flares, you evade the jam's missiles. But it's not very. This game is not challenging at all. See, if I didn't think the angle wasn't even that good, yet I ended up. Killing the guy or the jam. So Banshee to B3, the area looks clear. I think he said we can go there, refill, rearm, and all that stuff. And said B3, yeah, okay, okay, we can do that. Oh yeah. Uh, 
Benchy control, this is B tree and we're entering approach for uh, Benchy tree. Okay, we're going a little bit fast, boys. It does. I don't think it really matters because it's gonna get into like a little cutscene. Told you, it doesn't matter what you do. Just get close enough. You could go Mach ten. We'll get the cutscene and you're good. There. Yeah, so Banshee has three runways that so we can land three aircraft simultaneously. And it can also handle large transport aircraft. Although, it could probably just do one of them at the time. And somehow, they rearm and refuel the aircraft. I don't know how. Yeah, that was the, the Banshee cutting again. And we have to kill more of the jam. Once we got more ammunition, let's just destroy them and finish this mission, this mi um, mission faster. And someone got shot down there. Are we gonna get him? Probably, right? Yeah, we did. We always do. Get the two of them. Yep. Yeah. Like I said, this game is not very challenging. You just fire the missile and it's gonna hit. There was only one time I fired the missile and it didn't hit the guy because the angle was really bad and I was really close to the guy. So. So clear condition all enemy shot down. Let's return to base. You can come you can come back to base. Yeah, and that was the mission. Um, of course, we have to go to the return line because the the jam oh, they always show up when you're coming back. Makes you wonder how will the jam show up when you're coming back cuz it's supposed to be safe unsafe air zone. It's crazy, guys. So, no, three Type 1s. Since I have two more long-range missiles, why not just shoot them down, right? It's on the way. Kind of. Take that, fool. Why are my flares not... not going? Oh, they did. I just didn't hear the sound effect. That's crazy. Yeah, let's dive a little bit. Get some more airspeed and we're, we'll be clear of the, the airspace. Though, if you have watched the first episode, you see that in the very beginning, the gem can launch aircraft from under the ground. That explain that might explain why there are gem aircraft uh, pretty much anywhere that can at attack us. Like, good job, B3. We'll see you on radar or something that like that. And uh, welcome home. And mission 11 is accomplished. Sometime. Anytime? Yes. And yeah, that's kind of been a somewhat generic mission. What saves is, is Banshee because you have to land there. It's, it's pretty cool. And come on, Booker. Why do you always start at twenty at twenty seconds? Seriously. Nimu Gokuro that. Central computer. Konkai no Joe Homotoni. Yosoko dashtekita. Kongo jam ga aratana senditsu o uchitashtekuru kano se garuto. Isren se o yudan wa dekinai. Ningen wa jam ni katanak te wa ikinai da. So first, of course, says a good job for returning back alive and with true information. I think what he said was that the central computer, the central computer of the Fairy Air Force issued a report 
saying that with these new gem abilities we're gonna have a, like a tough time and basically that means humans cannot win this conflict tough tough information there for, for us to think and that's why you're gonna see that in the book they talk a lot about UAVs or even in the in the other mission that we did with the fan too a lot of machine learning to defeat, defeat the gem but anyways that was mission 11 and we're getting close to the end which is mission 14 hope you guys have enjoyed and see you guys next time